Hi guys, welcome to our channel. I'm Elvis and she is Inara. Mm -hmm. So today we're going to be talking about how I propose to this beautiful lady. She's how I unknowingly planned my dinner party. Amazing. Oh my god. So yeah, I'm going to back up on this, right? Because You're going to take it from the top. Yes. <laughs> on the actual top. Okay, no, no. so um um it was his 30th birthday. And that was June fifteenth, and um, I had like because usually every year I I, I like thing that I I top it. Mm. Yeah, I'm, I'm I'm bad like that. Okay, wait, wait. Okay, okay. I think from my, for the first okay from what we met the first so was a surprise cake, right? Mm -hmm. And I think did you get me phone? I can't remember. I think you got me phone. Mm -hmm. You got me I phone. Remember. Okay. And then you got me a suit. And That's some shirts, right? yes. But then again, it's not blurry. I can't remember. I can't remember, okay. but I know that I kept on, you know. I mean, I'm trying, okay. I'm, 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 I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. I mean, and uh, of course, for the last birthday, I, I gave him like the best gift ever. That was literally me. As in, you all, give, no, all of, no, 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 no. I collected, oh. <laughs> <laughs> you paid for. I know, I know. As, as Nami asked for to collect, whatever. I, I, I could have said no. Okay, okay. So, it's all good. It's I mean, all good. I, gave, it's all good. I gave you all of this. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, um, so yeah, I said I was going to back up um not a bit, back up a lot to pay ready. <laughs> okay, so basically it was 30th birthday and like I literally had everything all planned. I had no idea he was going to propose. In fact, I, I you know, most times like recently what people do is they actually propose on the girl's birthday. So for some reason I already thought that okay, December 15 is settled. That was when we were going to um, get engaged and all that. So that was what today. Yeah, I mean that's what they all do. Okay. At okay. least even if it's not this birthday, the next. At least you suspected that I would, yes, would have probably if I was going to do it, I was going to do it on, on your birthday. my birthday. Yes, okay. exactly. So I have planned everything out. Um, I mean I had planned this for like two months, two months leading up to June. <laughs> yes, I'm I'm that deep. <laughs> I'm that deep. So what I did is I had a co-planner. Shout out to Linda, my girl. Linda um, is like your girl, girl. Though. Yes, she's like my go-to girl. <laughs> she's my, she's my girl, girl, girl. Because even for the wedding, she was, yes, she, she was, was the same yeah. person. So shout out to you, Linda. What up? Okay. <laughs> so um, I had planned everything with her. Um, what what the first thing I did was chat up like everybody that literally mattered. Of course, his sisters. Um, the siblings could not be around because they were like far, far away. Look, but wait, the people that he sent in a video now. Okay, yeah. So we sent in a video. He sent in a video. Everybody that could Everybody, not be here yes. sent a video. So I had planned everything out like two months to June fifteenth. Um, I created broadcast lists to to have a group of people that I wanted to be at the birthday. Some could not make it, of course, but I mean and finalized all that we had people that were going to come in um gifts that's his friend from abuja yeah i literally like <laughs> gift you have to be here <laughs> if you're not here there's no point doing this <laughs> so please you have to be here so i had i put gifts then of course soul impact so many i mean like everybody that had to yes, be here uh, was it was here jinka was here jinka was, yes, was, was here even ayo was here ayo was around yes, yes. so Every, even Emmanuel, Ima that's oh in Canada God. was here. So I mean, it, it was. It, don't worry. Let's just let's just get <laughs> to the story. So um, I created a broadcast yeah. list. Started sending messages. I'm sure people were tired of me because I had sent in mess like reminders. Like they, they literally woke up to these messages. Hi guys, <laughs> remember June fifteenth? It always there. And at the end, I always kept on writing. It's a surprise. Please don't let him know. Give them. God, God, like, confess to this. <laughs> I, 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 I literally bugged these people. Thank you so much. Shout out to everybody that was here and that supported. And I'm really grateful. Anyway, so I had sent um, broadcast messages and then I had created flyers. Thanks to Linda once again. I had, we had a graphic artist do like, do like flyers and send out to people when we're sending out these um, messages and all that. Um, so, oh, and then aside that, I had planned um there's this video that i recorded or oh, that i asked people to send in and i collated everybody that could not um, be around so everybody that could not be around was on that video even on me 
Onome was in Abu. Was in the video. Was yeah. in that video. Yeah. So people that were out of the country or out of Lagos that could not make it here, they had to do a video. Everybody. And I literally had to remind Uncle Joe. Everybody. <laughs> I everybody had to remind video. them. I had to remind them every morning. Please don't forget to send me your videos. God bless you. <laughs> like, I was just going oh on. My God. So I, I, I got all of them to finally send in their videos, and then of course do the collating was crazy. But we finally created the video, and then I had to keep hiding my phone from him. So I literally changed everybody's name. You had, let's say, um, who, whose name can I use? Okaidi. Of course, I've not stored Okaidi's name as Okaidi. I now stored it as uh, OK, OK, Vid L. So, like different event is something, DJ something. Like, <laughs> I was just changing names. It was DJ Fresh, yeah. DJ, DJ Fresh, Fresh. Or Shout yeah. out. Yeah, so he was. And Samoot. Sam so. Exactly. <laughs> so basically, um, I planned all this. Of course, I had, I had gotten the lady for food, and there was, I had gotten somebody else to do swallow because I didn't want to hear the person for swallow was, was stuck in traffic and the person for rice could not make. So I made alternative plans. I'm deep, yes, I'm deep like that. So um, I woke up that morning, June 15. I was so excited. It was like I was planning my wedding. I was, <laughs> I was so excited. Like, you mean all this plan is today that we're going to finally. I mean, come to the the reality of it. I was so excited. So that morning, I called him so that he wouldn't suspect anything. I called him. How are you doing? Blah blah blah. He said he wasn't. He wasn't sure he was going to the office. Of course, that keep me away from the house because I needed to make sure the deco in the house. Oh yes, yeah, so we did the like mad deco. <laughs> oh my god. So I came. I I I came to. I I I went to see him. I came to see you, right? Yeah, you came to yeah and you said you were going to ch um, to work and all that. No, so I, okay. Okay, you you were not sure if you were going to work, but I insisted because I needed to keep you away from the house. So I kept him away um, from the house. We went to work, and then I kept on contacting Linda because she was she had the key to his house, and then she was the one telling guests, okay, this is the venue, this is the venue. Okay, so, so you took the key and gave it to her. Yes. So she was going to open the door and then make sure that the decor was everything, and she kept on sending me videos while I was with him. So he kept asking me, who are you chatting? Who are you speaking with? I'm like, no, nothing. Just WhatsApp video. Just, I mean. So, um, she there was no trust. I probably would have thought you were cheating though. Really? Because I was so sneaky. I was so scared. So, basically, Linda and I um, kept on chatting. She was showing me the videos and all that to, to be sure that the, the decor was to my taste. I kept on adjusting and tweaking no 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 put this there put this here put this here i said everybody was in on this one like if anything had happened or gone wrong that day i mean i've killed myself <laughs> even my mom was in on this like it was a full blow oh my, oh god. my goodness so um basically that day she so she was here decorating while i was trying to store him so i told my mom that okay my mom i kept up oh another thing is i kept on calling gifts because i think he had to fly from abuja that yeah. morning like I was praying because it now looked like it was going to rain and then your flight could be delayed. I was just begging. I asked him what time is your flight? He told me eight. I think he had to move it to six so that nothing can go wrong. I was that serious. So basically, um I had to distract him. So I called my mom and told her that we're coming to the house. You have to store all this as much as possible because everybody that needs to be at the house is not mm -hmm. there. And despite all the broadcast messages I sent. Please be punctual. Nigerians, why do we always go late for everything? There's African time, there's nothing Nigerian time. I, I couldn't understand it. Anyways, so people that were there is here, Lagos time. <laughs> <laughs> the traffic, oh my god. No, Lagos time is just peculiar to Lagos. God. So, everybody that was supposed to be here was actually not here. I had to store him. So I called my mom, um, she was at the house, and then I told her, Mom, just. Delay him as much as possible. So when I when he okay, went no there, wonder the prayers and yeah. Worship. So when he got there and then he thought it was just a simple prayer and then we went to full blown fellowship. He wanted to kill me, <laughs> so I had to go in and dress up and keep tabs with Linda and all that. And then um, so finally Linda said everybody is here and all that. But I had to come to the house to be sure that everything was okay. So I told him to give me a minute. Let me go. I think I said let me go somewhere. So he thought I was going to get his gift. No, I was actually going to check the house and make sure that everything was okay and everybody was inside. So when we when I came in, 
thank everybody. I said, okay, let me go and get him. So I went, I got him, and then he came here and then he opened the door. And he literally, in fact, he, he almost fainted. <laughs> you know, that's, that's still, are you? Like that's like the best birthday so far. First birthday so far. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I got married As to I, the next birthday now. So. Yeah. So, so that's story for another day. Oh. That's a wedding story. Yes. <laughs> So that's another one. So he came and then um I didn't I didn't know that he had bought a new ring. I didn't even know what was happening. So there's this wine that we kept, the one you won from Junior, where yeah. he said where we said we're going to keep for special occasions. And he said, Okay, I think and I didn't stand to actually bring out that wine. Like I said, oh finally we're going to open the wine. And then I went upstairs and then on my way down, I just saw people kneeling. I didn't really understand what's happening. He moved me around. I said, what? I'll be my sister. I was like, why, why, why are they kneeling? And then I came down and then he started telling me, no, come, come. And I said, come to where? I didn't even see Elvis well because I think when I came this way, I couldn't see you well. And now when I saw him kneeling with the ring, it's funny how we used to laugh at people that cry during their engagement. Yeah, engagement yeah. Yes. Because we literally. Well, recent, recently now, people are fainting though. <laughs> <laughs> How would you feel? This is a stranger that's to you. I don't know. Because really, we we we, we literally used to laugh at people like, why why are you why are you um, crying? You didn't know this, or you you were not okay. You were dating for what to go to to end up with? So I was amazed. I I was crying. He was it was so emotional, but it was so beautiful. I mean, it was like. The, uh, it was almost like the happiest day of my life, but then I got married to him. So, so yeah, that's such a beautiful story. Um, of course, you see pictures, and you appreciate the story, really. Yeah. So yeah, that's the engagement story. Mm -hmm. Hope you enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's how I plan, unknowingly plan. <laughs> how you <day>. plan? Because <laughs> I don't know how plan. So how I unknowingly plan my engagement party yeah you guys enjoyed it yeah <laughs>